New at nine dating sites could see much more user activity with Valentine's Day right around the corner, but that could put some of your private information online for scammers to see. Fox 31 problem solver Rogelio Mata spoke with a tech expert about what you can do to keep your information safe. Yeah, so there's any number of sites where you might find some of your own information online. And while you're on a dating site, be sure you trust the person before providing any information they could use to find out more about you. The internet can serve good and not so good purposes. People search websites can get information about you from data suppliers. What they're doing is behind your and my back, they're buying data about us, including where we live, our phone numbers, everything about us. Mark Kepsinski is with OneRep. That's a site that scrubs your personal information off the internet. If a scammer gets you in a vulnerable spot, they can start using your personal information against you. And they can do that on many platforms, including dating sites. We let our guards down, right? Because we're looking for love. We're looking for, you know, our mate and our partner in life. A quick casual chat might give them an opening to something they could search about you online from a people search website. Unfortunately, uh, both fraudsters and people who potentially just, you know, can't take no for an answer, um, you know, it's super easy for them to look you up on the internet. Kepzinski says, have a chat, enjoy the chase, but keep some bits of information about you to yourself until you're very sure about the person you're talking to. Until you really know someone and maybe feel comfortable with them, uh, don't give out uh, your personal information. So, you know, try to hold back your last name, hold back where you live, your mobile phone number. Services like those offered by Kepsinski's site can remove your personal information from other sites where anyone could search and find out more about you. The problem is that there's just so many websites. Like we scrub uh, at one rep here, we scrub from 200 different websites. So this is an issue that can affect you over time as well. Experts say your information could be deleted from a site only to reappear just months later. For that reason, many of these scrubbing services are, in fact, subscription-based. In studio, Rogelio Modest, Fox 31.